How to create a bot in PoAI. In this video, we're quickly going to be discussing on how you can easily create a bot in PoAI in the easiest way. So to start things off, what you're going to do is you're going to come over to Po.com. Now over here, you can go ahead and sign in. Okay, so you can either sign in with an email or you can use any Gmail or Apple account you have. So I'm going to be using an email for myself. So this temp email is the thing that I'm going to be adding in this section, but you can use any email that you have. You can even use your phone number. Now, once you've added the email that you have, you're going to go over to your inbox because that is where you're going to get the verification or confirmation link for yourself. So to check it out, I'm going to open it up right here and the confirmation link should appear right here so as you can see you have your verification code right in front of you i'm going to go ahead and open that up and here we have the confirmation code so i'm going to go ahead and copy that and paste it right here now once we've pasted this we're just going to, we're just going to verify it and bring it here now once we do that what you're going to be doing is you're going to be choosing your nationality okay because according to that you are going to be adding the phone number. So once you've chosen your nationality from here, you're going to add your phone number. All right. So once you do this, you're going to click on add. And once you click on add, what that will do is you are going to get straight into it. Now, once you've gone through with the necessary verifications, it's going to bring you here. So this is basically the Power AI chat section where you can actually start a new chat for yourself. Now, we're here to create a bot, so we're going to get straight into it by clicking on create bot over here. Now, once you do that, it says complete your pro, pro profile to continue. So I'm going to go ahead and add a name. Once you add a name, you're going to click on next. It says add a picture. You can simply skip that if you want to. I'm going to go ahead and review everything. And here we are. So first of all, we have a handle. So it should be a unique handle. Let's say I'm going to call it Jonathan bot. AI. That is what we're going to be calling it. And you're going to make sure that it has underscore and other symbols. Then it says bot behavior. So either you can use a server, which could be a discord server where you have uploaded the actual API of the bot, or what you can do is you can use a prompt. All right. So the prompt could be chat GPT based. It could be Dolly three based playground three stable diffusion, Claude, and so on. Now, if you want it to be an image generator, you're going to choose it from Dolly or the other whatnots. But if you want it to be an actual chat, you can use the rest of the bots that you can see over here. All right. So I'm going to stay with the basic, which is ChatGPT. And here it says, tell your bot how to be even how to respond to user messages. So you can actually check the actual best practice for text generation on Poe's very own detailed briefed website. So let's say I'm going to write, you are John bot and you will answer all questions and queries stated by users. Okay, we're going to write that in. Then it says knowledge base. So what is the base of your knowledge? You can add a proper knowledge source. Okay. You can add a line of text, any line of attachment, greeting message. You, let's say hello. Then we have advanced. Okay. You can suggest replies, render markdown content and add custom temperature. And moving on, we have bio profile. Okay. So this is going to be a bot profile. What people expect from your bot. This isn't too important. But once this is done, you're simply going to click on create. And once you do all of that, you're going to click on continue. And as you can see, we have a bot now. So now you can actually talk to this bot. So let's say I want to write, tell me the, uh, let's say Pythagoras theorem. Okay. I'm going to write that in. And once we write that in, look at that. It starts answering the question for me. So pretty incredible and pretty useful, right? So you can ask it any question. Let's say I'm going to write, write me a simple C++ code for Pac-Man. So I'm going to, you know, ask it a coding question and look at that. It starts creating me a code for a video game. So 
this is basically the main idea on how you're going to create your very own bot on Poe AI. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, do let me know down in the comments below and I'll be making more for you. Till then, that is all from me and I'll be seeing all of you in the next video. Have a great day and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.